<laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> Loves. Welcome back to a new vlog. I'm just here with David who's using GPS to find Castle Loma. Yeah. That's how you know we're lost. <laughs> like we're, we're about in the to middle go. of um, forest, which okay, I it's... totally hate because I had like so many bed bu bugs. Bed, bed bugs, bugs are no. inside. <laughs> Insect bugs. Oh yes. From the beach. But the weather should be mild enough that there is not too many of that out. But <clears throat> this is giving me PTSD from Sintra when I did not have the right shoes to be walking no trails there. Same situation today if you can see I got sandals on. Trying to be pretty because hopefully I'll be a good content creator and take an Instagram pic at some point but we'll see. First we got to enjoy the vibes. I do love the nature walk though. I don't. It's so peaceful. We can go that way. Do you want to go We're in the back side no? There's an entrance over there, so I'm wondering if that's where we have to Yeah, because like, uh, we just came from Castle and we're looking for something. I like places that are just so good. We're trying to be economical and save money and be healthy. We always end up somewhere about to eat. See how well I do. I guess no game right now. <laughs> I didn't know it's a pizza. I teach him for two years and he still can't do it. He come with his waist? No. Come teach me how to move I cannot. Move I cannot. I, I, I need you to teach me how to move my waist. To shake your ass. <laughs> oh, the days are slowly, slowly getting shorter. This is the first summer where it's July and I'm like, summer's done. Usually I wait until when the CNE begins. If you know, you know. That's usually what Torontonians say is the end of summer. But something about this year. It's already done. I left the crew. David invited two of his friends. It was nice to meet them. I didn't show you guys them on the vlog since it was my first time meeting them. It'd be kind of weird to shove a camera in their face, but they were laid back. I'm just in a different headspace. I'm super tired and I'm not in a drinking mood. So I kind of politely bowed out because <laughs> I got a lot to do tonight. I actually have my second vlog uploading. I uploaded one yesterday. I'm gonna do one for today, one for tomorrow, and then another one. So four back to back to back. I hope you guys are ready for that. Since we're just trying to wrap up July before August comes, and August is what? Tuesday? <laughs> so I gotta hurry up. I also gotta do a Patreon video sometime this week. I'm supposed to do at least one a month. I remember doing one in May, because I filmed it the day before my trip. I don't think I did one in, no, I did do one in June. But July flew by. So I'm gonna go shower, wash my hair, 
Luckily the rain didn't come like the weather predicted. And edit. So you won't see much of me. Mondays are boring so I'll probably skip that so I can really focus on what I need to do. And yeah, it's so weird. <laughs> David was talking about Alicia 2.0 since I'm in a transitory stage of my life. And yeah, can't really say much more about it than that. We all go through different seasons and phases. I talk about that all the time on my pods, both the public and the Patreon one. So I'm just in the season of shedding the old as far as my old thought patterns, beliefs, and habits, and deciding what I'm going to keep and discerning what I'm gonna bring forward and what doesn't serve me. So it's a lot of internal work. I don't know if that's gonna be interesting for a vlog or a dedicated video, but <laughs> work needs to be done. We're constantly under construction. Curly hair, girly. Maybe I'll straighten my hair tomorrow. I don't feel like doing it tonight. Maybe I'll leave it curly for a week. I don't know. I'm so confused. I this. usually let my computer upload overnight because 4K is no joke. It takes sometimes 12 to 18 hours to upload one vlog. I came to my computer this morning and I'm like, hold up. Why is the screen off? Please tell me. This computer's old, but it's not this old. Hold on. Hold on. We're going home. I go over to the oven and I realize, oh, there must have been a power outage. My computer turned on just fine, but we're only at 66%. I'm hoping the vlog will be up by noon, but let's be real, it probably won't be up until tonight. So we'll see. Speaking of tonight, I might as well set up this so that I can get to the pods. If you guys don't know, I have a podcast called Authentic with Alicia. I have two. The public one talks about pop culture as it relates to authenticity, and the private one is more of a personal antidote. So if you want to support, you can head over to both. That's ready to go. I just realized, though, I won't be able to do it as soon as I'm done work. I have a therapy session. If you're new to my channel, I started going to therapy shortly after my dad passed away. The first year was super helpful. This year, honestly, not so much. Even she said, I really don't know what to tell you because you're doing everything. It's just a matter of your life not reflecting your actions. Like usually my clients, they don't listen or they don't take instruction or they don't take action. You do all of the above, but I don't know if that's a good problem to have. But anyway, let's start work. I'll check in with you guys later on today. This is cool. See what I have to do since I can't see the buttons. Is that my tummy? I'm gonna eat in a second. I hope you guys can't see my food. I just feel like when food is not cooked fresh, it never looks as good. I wish we could go back in time. Set. Wait, hold on. Is clock set or does clock reset? Let's try. Okay, now press it. Just a test. Oh, shit. Shoot. I shouldn't swear. Darn it. Because I don't get it. No, it's not working. Wait, what the heck? That's why. I think I accidentally... No, it's not moving. The time. Now I gotta do the microwave. I need to stop yawning when I hit record. It's a very bad app. 8.43, so after I set the two clocks, my uncle called me and we were just talking about some nutrition stuff. If you don't know, I studied nutrition a million years ago. That was my undergrad. Still have a little things, a few things on my mind that I can always share. Why am I holding an avocado? I was gonna make guac, but I'm full from the pasta I had earlier. So, therapy went well. Uh, if the world was a better place, I would share what happened in the session in hopes that it would help somebody else. But since <laughs> not everyone that watches A cares or B has good intentions, I'll save that for myself. But sometimes I wish I could share things. So if you're going through the same thing, then you can have some insight or feel like you're not alone or you're not like, woohoo. So because we're all going through it. Sometimes we don't talk about it and sometimes we go on social and we see things and it's not actually what it is. But now I'm gonna do my two pods so I can have them scheduled for 8 a.m. tomorrow. Check it out if you haven't already. I'm so sad to hear my favorite character from you four passed away. It's so sad when people die young. I don't care how rich, famous, unknown you are. A life that is short, it just feels like the possibilities were shortened, so. I don't know if that's gonna be the subject of my pod tonight. And what else, what else? There's something else I was gonna to say to you guys and it fell out of my head, which probably means that I should just focus on these things and go to bed. <laughs> I probably won't check in with you guys tomorrow, let me keep it real, because I just wanna focus on being in office and getting through that. It's Tuesday, a little after 10 p.m. 
15. I mean, it's probably not the best time to start this curly to straight process, but I have a feeling by Saturday I'm gonna regret making it straight anyway, but hey, it'll be easier for tomorrow in office, so let's get to it. Where's my clip? It'll be, it'll be, it'll be half an hour. Oh my gosh, if I haven't told you, I'm obsessed with this hair, or rather scalp serum, it's so luxurious. I don't even know if it works, to be honest. All I do know is it smells amazing, and my scalp feels hydrated. It's supposed to make hair grow, but uh, Patchy to Patch says maybe not. <laughs> I could be starting a trend. A little fringe never hurt no one. I need some supplies. Some Nowadays I just use this and a little bit of this other serum from the Black Hair Care Store. Yeah, that was the first company to ever send me a thing. They reached out to me on Twitter. It was definitely more than 10 years ago, which is so crazy. I remember being shocked like me, little old me. I miss doing hair care product reviews. Happy Friday, loves. Let me just turn this off before I get copyrighted. So, it is almost three, and my boss is like, you should have logged off earlier. You know how it goes for long weekends. You can leave early on Friday when your work is done, but being blind, it took me a little longer. Anyway, I have a special guest to share with you guys today. She's visiting from the weekend, for the weekend? She's visiting for the weekend all the way from Antigua. It's my cousin, and you'll see her in a sec, because we're gonna go out for sushi. I'm so excited, I'm so hungry. The weather's really playing because it looks like it's going to rain every 30 seconds and then the sun comes out. Sunglasses and umbrella. You know you're from New York when? 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 Nine o'clock. Hi! I'm going to take this downstairs. Hi! What's up? I'm going to FaceTime me so I can be like, you know, acting like I'm the in person. Yeah, you can switch it. You can tap the FaceTime right. button. You're at your job or you're at home? She doesn't go yeah, in. I'm working from the house. Oh. W F H. <laughs> Work from home. <laughs> so but fun. I'm though. I know y'all gonna have a good time. We're gonna try. <laughs> just you know, just caught me in a picture. Y'all know my angles. Like that's all. You know what's good too. That you cannot buy, that me in love that you cannot mix. One is the joy that you cannot wait, and the other one price. So Daniel is putting you guys on the honey garlic chicken. It is wondrous. Man with this list, if you cannot pray, I need to find the leaves. I'll be honest. Um, first of all, Jesus created dance hall, and second of all, I was listening to Soka, so he's fine with both. Jesus, Jesus created dance hall? Yes. You ever listen to the lyrics and what they talk about? No. Oh, I try not okay. to. <laughs> okay. It's for God so loved the world, that's what they sing about. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. You go ahead, you, you go ahead and backslide this weekend. Go what, ahead. What do you mean? God knows we're human. Right? No, that's not what I was saying at all. She used to be, she was on reggae, reggae sunsplash couple. She was in Jamaican reggae sunsplash singing gospel. She sings gospel now. Oh, that's she, good. She's a, she's a gospel um, singer. She used to be the, the, queen of, the queen of dance. Uh, she used to be slack. Oh, so not good then. She's the one who was putting down Sensia when Sensia was was going out with her slackness and, and stuff like that. She was the one who was saying, was trying to put her down. Sensia's all right, man. Yeah, they already donated all of the fresh food to the food banks. I'm happy to hear that because food banks usually don't get fruits and vegetables to begin with. Oh, they did that already? Mm -hmm. I was waiting for a streetcar, so I had my phone read it out to me. So that's good though. Mm -hmm. But still, that's not good enough. Mm -mm. You know what I'm saying? 
They shouldn't have been paying those people so little. I have to go light today. I can't well, we were going to be light anyway because we okay. have to wake up and do a lot tomorrow. I won't be able to function. <laughs> Somebody else is biting in the camera instead of me. Who shared this thing with me? I did not. I didn't know that people look like this girl. Yeah, this doesn't look like the other one. I saw her, like she leaned along. Us? Oh, 
Very delicious, Patsy. Wow. This is good though. Even though it's a mask. Hey guys, so I have two crispy fish tacos. Oh. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> Or a vanilla shot. I don't know. Because it's very grassy. Flocky oh. close at six and come five five o'clock by your side. The entire world wanted to copy. Oh, I was the like, last minute? yeah, like the last hour. It was like so busy. Like a lineup the whole time. But whatever. We were like we got too lucky. Rest you vlogging? That's the worst. I'm trying to do the accent. We're on route. A little bit behind. We're on our way to Markham Fairgrounds for a Carnival Kingdom party. I'm so excited to see Shinsuke. But it would still be called Markham, no? Oh, so we don't have to worry tonight then. Okay. Is there like a big parking lot or something that everyone? There is. is does it tell the time? No, close.
Good morning, guys. I'm here with my uncle again, who hates the vlogging. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I'm becoming a kind of person. Less stress about things. That's good if you... You said it's the only acceptable one and it's the only one you can go to. I was 11 years old walking through Hogwarts. So this is my old university campus. And I haven't been here. Yeah, let's do it. I haven't been here since 2011. So it's taking my uncle and my cousin from Antigua to bring me back to my old stomping grounds. See how many hours, moments, and time spent here. In a couple weeks, it's going to be packed here with fresh eyes. This is a throwback. I feel like this is a major throwback. I haven't been back in Mac in years, but of course, we used to come to Mac like it was going out of fashion. Anytime we go to the States, we'd find a Mac or Sephora and go crazy. This is back when Sephora didn't really exist in Toronto. Actually, no. We just like to shop for makeup back then, but times have changed. Did you find it? I did, but I was just testing the other ones that are also brown just to see if I do actually have the right shade for mine. She made it to the Toronto sign. I'm gonna do one this way. What a weekend. It was a whirlwind. I usually start weekly vlogs on Sundays. I knew and I decided that we were gonna wrap it up here instead, seeing that my cousin is boarding her flight right now, and I figured we'd wrap it up when she's wrapping up this leg of her trip. It was such a treat to see her, even if it was so short, and to experience Caravana as an all adult. She hasn't been back since 96. Like, she's been in Toronto, but to the parade and all of that, it's been a minute. Even with me, like I told you yesterday, it's been 10 years since I've been there and I was in the parade playing mass. So to be on the other side and not see anything, while life legally blind, it really shows you how time can fly, but at the same time, so much can happen. And just processing, like I said, I don't wanna get into too much, cause I already feel like this vlog is gonna be really long. Editing Alicia, good luck girl. Before I wrap up this weekly vlog, but I am planning on taking a break. Sometimes I go on hiatuses and I don't tell you guys, and then you DM, and I feel so bad that I make you worry. So for a change, I'm intending on taking a break and I'm letting you know, especially vlogs, I'm gonna take a big break from vlogs. Don't know how long. The time that it takes for me to pick an aesthetic shot or angle things or film something in my life or even decide to do something to make the vlogs interesting, I kind of use that time and pour into myself and just shift into a different stage. Not to say I don't love vlogging and complete transparency if it wasn't for you guys during the pandemic. When everyone was complaining about being lonely during that time, I felt like I had you guys, even though I live alone. I never felt like I was alone when we were doing the kitchen chat, so I was just showing you my regular boring everyday life. I don't know how you guys watched me back then, but I'm grateful all the same. And it's hard because I need and I want a change in my life. And I kind of want to document that for two reasons to share with you guys. But it's also selfish because I love that when I vlog, I can actually see what's happening. Like, I can't wait to see this footage zoomed up while I'm editing and be like, oh, that's what was happening or that's what they were talking about. In a way, I think it's more important at this stage for me to slow down and use that time spent editing, recording, filming, all that to do other things in my life. So if and when we get back to the vlogs because who knows maybe the content will change on my channel and we'll start doing sit down videos again or something else but whenever i do i feel like it'll be better for you too so i just want to thank you guys so much each and every one of you who've spent any amount of time especially if you made it to the end of this video and you're hearing these moments if you want to keep up with me i'll still be potting authentic with alicia it's not as taxing as far as time goes and it's a real good creative outlet for me to just grow and learn with you guys along the way the patreon fam knows exactly what i'm talking about so on that note oh i feel like i'm supposed to be starting a new vlog right now i'm like so much in the routine and i mean that's part of it creating content for 13 years not quitting youtube altogether but it's just like whoa you know or maybe you don't know <laughs> either way what i'm trying to say is I hope that you guys will be well, and until next time, stay safe, stay sane, stay blessed. Love later. Still finding myself, let alone a soulmate. I'm just saying.
feel like we want it. My stepdad loves yeah. sage fragrances. I <laughs> found a few he likes too. It's such a pretty color. I use oil, I use butter. I know you were telling me that last time with the plantain too. Bless, bless, bless. <laughs> I need you to post it now. I can see you posting this. 